Good morning. We are going to start day six of our maths. Please write today's short date as Roman numerals. Today we will be learning to use ratio to solve problems involving the relative sizes of two quantities. Your task is going to be from Target Your Math, page 70. We're going to start off with mental maths. Please complete that and then watch the ratio video from Math Antics. Please look at the link below. Right, let's go over some examples, a visual example of ratio. So Ben the painter needs six litres of dark purple. He uses four litres of red paint and two litres of blue paint. Write the ratio of the number of red tins to the number of blue tins in its simplest form. So we know that the ratio is four to two. To find the, sim the ratio in its simplest form, you do four divided by two, which is two, and then you do two divided by two, which is one. So the ratio of four two in its simplest form is two one. Okay. This is another example. Sarah has a number of white and black counters in a bag. You need to write the ratio of the number of black counters to the number of white counters in its simplest form. So there are three black counters and nine white counters. To find the ratio in its simplest form, you need to divide three by three, which is one, and you divide 9 by 3, which is 3. So it's 1, 3. Here are some examples. So simplify 25, 30. 25, 30. Well, we know that 25 and 30 are in the 5 times table. So you do 25 divided by 5, which is 5, and 30 divided by 5, which is 6. So, simplifying 25 over 30 is 5, 6. Let's simplify 48, 32. 48, 32, both are in the 8 times table. So you do, would divide 48 by 8, which is 6, and then 32 divided by 8, which is 4. So the simplest form is 6, 4. Have a go at doing 75, 1.25. Oh, you can simplify that for even further. If you do 6 and 4, they're both in the 2 times table. So you do 6 divided by 2, which is 3, and 4 divided by 2, which is 2. You can make 3, 2. This can be done in one step by dividing by 16. Then you have 75 pence over 125. Change to the same units before simplifying and dropping drop the units. So 75 and 125. So instead of saying one pound 25, change it to pence, 125 pence. Well, we know that 75 divided by 25 pence is 3 and 125 divided by 25 pence is 5. There's 3. OK, so you're going to all try and complete before you do the task on page 70. Exercise one. So number one, simplify the following expressions, A, B, C, D, E. Then number two, you're going to follow, simplify the following expression by converting the units. So remember, four centimetres and 10 millimetres, you would need to convert four centimetres into millimetres. So we know that one centimetre is the same as 10 millimetres. So four centimetres would be 40 millimetres. And do the same with 60 centimetres, converting the 1.05 metres into centimetres. And then three, three kilogram needs to be converted into grams. And the two hours needs to be converted into minutes. Remember, one hour is equivalent to 60 minutes. So what would two hours be? 
After you've done that, I'd like you to answer the following, solve the following problems. 125 men and 150 women are at a wedding. Write this as a ratio of men to women in its simplest form. And number four, a painter mixes 65 litres of red and 15 litres of blue paint to get purple. Write this as a ratio of red to blue in its simplest form. And number five, a model of a plane is 30 centimetres. The real plane is 60 metres. Write this as a ratio of a model to real life in its simplest form. And number six, a recipe contains 0 0.3 kilogram of sugar and 49.5 grams of butter. Write this as a ratio of butter to sugar in its simplest form. This is the time for you to pause the button, press pause and complete the work. I will be really, really revealing the answers after this. Right, I hope you've all had a go. Here's the answer. Please look at the answer and see if you've got those right.